NBC4's Today in L.A. at 5 starts now. There are already some California power crews on the East Coast helping out, and there are hundreds more getting ready to head that way. As we told you earlier here on Today in L.A., SoCal Edison crews will leave this morning for the East. Tony Guignard is live at the company plant in Menifee out in Riverside County, where they're packing up their gear. And Tony, about 170 people are headed East. Uh, yeah, a lot more details uh, right now because we have some company here who can fill us in. But just think about it, some 8.2 million customers without power uh, up and down the East Coast. A lot of them are Con Ed customers and they requested some help. California, uh, Southern California Edison has answered that call. I want to go to Dan Chung with SoCal Edison. You will be sending a convoy out 730 this morning. Oh, what's rolling out with them? So Southern California Edison has been and asked through the Edison Electric Institute. We have a mutual agreement with Con Ed, and we've been asked to help them during this uh, trying time with Hurricane Sandy. What we have in place and what we've assembled is a group of 170 Southern California Edison employees made up of contractors and employees, as well as 54 vehicles that are going to be flatbedded this morning onto low boys, and we're going to ground transport them to the Con Ed service territory so that we can assist with their power restoration. Where exactly will your crews be working? Uh, we'll be assigned according to what Con Ed's needs are. Uh, we're there to provide them assistance, and we're there in a mutual support agreement. So we'll go by whatever direction that they give us. One of the interesting things is you have a mobile command center that you're also sending. What can that be used for? Why are you utilizing that? Southern California Edison is proud to be on the cutting edge of technology. And this vehicle, if you can picture a massive RV, if you will, has uh, the capability of satellite communications, uh, laptop drops, com networks, uh, phones. It's a communication hub that we can use for any emergency. And we're going to be watching it when it rolls out. I'm going to get some more information from you in just a moment. Uh, stick with uh, Today in L.A. because we will be here when that convoy rolls out. I'm Tony Ginyard reporting live from Menifee 4 Today in L.A. All right, great, Tony. Thanks so much.